Hi, uh, this is Projector Dude. This is a video demo. This is the uh, Panasonic. This is the FW430. It is a commercial WXGA projector, which means that it does 1610, 169 native. It's a widescreen projector. Uh, it's 3500 lumens. They get 6,000 hours. This is right there, that's a 128 inch screen, so it's over scanning that in 16.9. Let's go ahead and. <sighs> really good video. This is coming through HDMI, coming off my computer. But it also does uh, mobile HDMI, so it'll work off your iPad, your phone, your iPhone, pretty much anything that's HDMI. Very quiet projector. This is on low lamp. And uh, it's a bright room. I mean, you can see uh, the lights coming in. So... Uh, it does have a uh, digital lens shift if you're in 16.9. Uh, it also has left and right, up and down uh, lens shift right here at the lens. The best part about these things is they get a solid 6,000 hours and they stay bright. And I mean they stay bright. I've had them 10,000 hours. What happens is, is at 6,000 hours, the chip on the lamp will tell you. And it will keep throwing a warning that your lamp is up. You can just replace the chip, which you can't really find the chips unless you're a Panasonic guy. Or you can just snap the chip off of the, uh, the lamp housing. It'll throw a lamp warning every once in a while. It'll be a pain in the ass. It'll come up and say lamp warning. But it, we've had 10,000 hours on these things, and they're still bright like this. But that's the original, uh, you tell the, the original Panasonic lamp. You can't put generic lamps in these. Uh, the lamp, this is a brand new lamp in this. And as a Panasonic guy, I paid 160 bucks, or normally 330. But it's really what you have to pay to get this type of picture. Generic, cheap lamps that you're going to get on Amazon or eBay, most of the time they're counterfeit or they're junk. You're going to get burnt. Make sure that you have the original equipment manufacturer lamp coming in, or a real equivalent from a company that you trust or know. This has a very loud speaker in it too. I have it turned down. But this is a uh, commercial projector. Really good speaker. And it's turned down at the, uh, turned way down at the computer. This has a massive filter. You could use this outdoor as long as the humidity or it's not too cold. And I really haven't set this one up yet, so I have no idea. What it's going to look like. Oh, this is what my existence is. Speakers, speakers. I have a whole downstairs full of commercial projectors. And high-end audio equipment and commercial audio equipment. But what am I listening to now? I'm listening to those little missions. They're from 19, there was a speaker of the year in Great Britain in 1984. For a reason, they sound amazing. So do the uh, 4312Bs, they sound amazing also. Uh, Bose 201's not bad little speakers. I mean, if you can pick them up for 120 bucks, 150 bucks, jump on them. They're not bad speakers. I mean, Bose gets a, a bad name sometimes, but they're... Uh, if you position them right, they sound pretty good. But nothing like those little missions. They, they just sound amazing. Yeah, there's some Harman Kardon, there's a Harman Kardon down there too, which is all seized drivers. I mean, that's some really good stuff. I mean, Harman Kardon is like JBL. They use some high quality stuff. They sound amazing also. And, yeah, that's a 3500 Epson I'm using now. 
a demo projector that actually still belongs to the company. Uh, but if you buy this projector, you're going to be very happy. It's got great LCD color. The only drawback is it, it does have a little bit of a pixel grid if you get right on top of it. But for most people, it's not going to be an issue. It, it has pretty much the same picture that you're going to get from that Epson, but brighter. It just has a little bit more of a pixel grid because of the resolution. But from about 8, 10 feet away, it disappears. It looks amazing. And plus you get 6,000 hours out of the lamp. And it's quiet as shit. Uh, this has been Projector Dude. This has been a Panasonic uh, FW. 430U. Hi, uh, this is Projector Dude. This is a video demo. This is the uh, Panasonic. This is the uh, FW430U. You can see a bunch of them here. Uh, this is a LCD projector that's 3500 lumens. And it is a very good video. Home theater video machine. I mean, it gets 6,000 hours out of the lamp. You've got to use the original lamp. Uh, this is a new original Panasonic lamp, and this is projector has 6,000 hours. These are very dependable, very tough commercial projectors. They never miss a beat. We've got 10,000 hours out of the original Panasonic lamps. Uh, you can't just reset the lamp hours on these. The, uh, the lamp tracks its own hours. So when you buy one of these and it says it has this many lamp hours, you can believe it because there's just no way to change it in the projector or in the menu. You physically have to change the chip and chips are not easy to come by I mean if you're a Panasonic dealer like I am I'm sure you can get your hands on them but this is for sure a brand new and it has zero hours and all the other ones have the original chips and the original lamps I check all the time uh, these all are school projectors uh, they have great sound they're very quiet and like I say, they're, they're some of the most dependable projectors you can buy. They're commercial projectors. They're straight up with lens shift, left and right, up and down. Amazing zoom range. You can be as 120 inch pick. You can be 10 feet away, all the way up to 22 feet away. And I mean, uh, the speakers in it are very good. You don't even need a sound bar. Even with a room full of people, if you amp up the sound, it's loud. Uh, very easy to use menu. I'd highly recommend any of these panties because uh, they just have really good video. The only downside is is you don't want this type of LCD projector if you're right on top of the picture. So if, if you're like six feet away, you will see a little bit of a picture grid. You're better for the DLP or a very high resolution home theater projector. But this is super bright. And if you're anywhere from eight to ten feet away, the pixel grid just disappears and the video is just really good. Uh, this has been Projector Dude. This has been a video demo. This has been the Panasonic FW430U. Oops. Hi, uh, this is Projector Dude. This is a uh, video demo. Oops.